became a member of the fire department to serve my community and help others. It's also a family tradition. I've been a member since July 1998. One of the things I really like about our department is we have the annual 9-11 ceremony, which we've had ever since the tragedy in, uh, in New York and Washington, with, along with Flight 93. Some of the benefits we have here at the Citizens Host Company as a volunteer firefighter are we're eligible for the state pension. We also have a membership in the blood bank. So I've never actually saved a life, but I've been fortunate enough to save some pets. I've saved a bird in a cage before when I was really young, and then I've saved some cats. Always wanted to join the fire department. I just decided I wanted to do it uh, to help my community and uh, just get a little excitement in my life. I've been a member for going on four years. To me, most is the brotherhood, the camaraderie. The you know, I've never really had close knit people that will drop everything to come help you and help a person that they have no idea who they are. When you go on a call, you're you're going to someone at their worst moments, and just you be in there helping them impacts people every day. You rescue people from bad situations and things like that, but you also impact lives when we have the 9-11 ceremony. You impact lives when the children come up here to do the fire prevention, and when you see a kid walking by the firehouse and they come in and jump up in the trucks, and you can see how much what we do impacts everyone. It's just something that you can't find anywhere else. I joined because it runs in my family. My grandfather is a past chief of the department. My uncle is a firefighter in the department, and I also, my dad is as well. And it also enabled me to get back to my community. I've been a member for four and a half years now. I actually got to go in and fight fire with my uncle, which was pretty cool. It's definitely an experience being able to go in with your family. It makes you feel good about yourself because you know you're doing something for someone else, even though you don't have to. Like, this is something I signed up for. It was definitely a commitment. And I know that I made a commitment to other people in my community to be there when they need it the most. I wanted to give it back to my community, protect people property. And besides getting to the seat of the fire is to protect their heirlooms. It takes a group effort because we gotta know what each other's doing. You know, it takes more than one person. My whole family on my mom's side is a fireman. They're all chiefs and lieutenants and captains up north. Watching them run out of the house and when the fire whistle blows, just I've always wanted to be with them and be a part of it. I've been a member uh, of about four years now, almost five. I think it was my junior year I joined. So as soon as I started driving on my own, I joined. You can turn somebody's worst day into the best day by just trying to help them as much as you can. Just like every other fireman, if you go into a house fire, seeing those flames and the smoke rolling down the street, an adrenaline rush you can't explain. One of the best things, I love come running, rushing up here and getting on a truck and going to help somebody, especially on house fires. There's a challenge to it, and I was like a challenge. You kind of see the impact it has on other people, and through the impact it has on the other people, it kind of has an impact on you yourself. You become more aware of what's actually the meaning of what you're doing. It kind of grows inside of you. A lot of good friendships up here. We're very family oriented, and we try to save a lot of our family's history. And to me, that's the same thing I'm going out to try to do is save somebody's family's history. Take care of the people, take care of your community, do the best you can. And to me, it's just to kind of stay lay low and answer the call. My name's Chris Hudson. I'm a past president of the fire department, currently an active firefighter. My name's Michael O'Neill. Um, I'm a firefighter, active firefighter right now, and I currently hold the position of lieutenant. My name is Taylor Sullivan. I'm a Black Hat firefighter. My name is Curtis J. Heath. I'm a past fire chief and driver. My name is uh, Nico Dias. I'm uh, currently the 2020 fire lieutenant. My name is Wayne Ford. I've been here 46 years. Um, I'm a firefighter, engineer, and driver. 